Hello all, we are now watching Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, episode 27. So in the last episode we saw, Edward made a promise to Al that he'll save him while he's, his body's down there starving. And in the meantime, Al and his armored body is about to go meet Father with Gluttony. What a weird combo. And uh, yeah, let's see what happens from there. Interesting. Walk into Attack on Titan. Oh. Oh, that's the mother? It's unhealthy to drink alone. It is? Is it? Oh, cool. Oh, another intro. We saw Mustang. Mm. And this dude. This jail. Scar as usual. Wow, there's some new characters. With some pink lipstick. <laughs> wow, this intro is, uh... Oh, that's from the last episode. It's cool they added that. Nice. This is their fun music. Oh yeah, this is the bombardment of Israel. I'm afraid it's not just the east. There have been oh, reports Hughes? of uprisings in the north and west as well. Things began to move more toward the militaristic when the current Fuhrer, King Bradley, first came into power. Mm. Weren't your two boys around her age? when they started planning to bring back their mom. Oh, so this is the present. I thought that was the past. Yeah, I thought so too. No! God, what am I doing? Mom, please. <laughs> Why do they have to give me this nightmare fuel again? Just give it back. He's my little brother. He's all I have left. That seems always good. Might be able to get your body back. Like we're going through a replay. This is the devil's research. Destroyed. They are doing a replay. That's cool. Really fascinating to see this. The human race goes through his dance. That's what he's thinking. It's remarkable how weak they are. They have an innate fear of the dark. And how do they handle this fear? They simply There's twins? It doesn't. They so one of them is... They certainly do make a good natural resource. It's all they're good for. Mm. Full, full metal alchemist. Rock health? Yeah. Winry's. Isn't that Winry's last name too? Yeah. It's like they're telling us how everything goes. All right then, let's see what you got. This guy was great too, his voice actor. We so all we're miss... gonna see Barry the Butcher? We all miss Barry, of course. And the music on the show is so good. With bodies like these, are we really even people? A fundamental question about people on the show. That's why he'll want to meet me. And I guess I'll find out what that <laughs> means. The teacher seems to be a worthy candidate for human sacrifice, too. Oh, did they grab the teacher? I've been sitting here a while, trying to decide what you mean by sacrifice. Trying to figure out why I'm here. Is the episode that reveals it? That's the ones we see on Envy. That's really cool though. The animation. They either run away or they roll over. <laughs> They're so fragile. How can they not break? I agreed. You know what that means, right? I forgot about him. Human. Godzilla. I came close to passing out from the pain. He's ripped. <laughs> To regret the form I have now would mean not only rejecting alchemy, but also turning my back. It's not about the human race, too. Like humans, you know, you live with it because that's what you're you born as. That was well played, girl. I just realized the dog shaking the uh, the arm because he was like, <laughs> "Oh, <laughs> that's so grisly, so grisly." You know that they're going to wind up dead no matter what you do. You're left with nothing. That's what the smart thing to do. The only thing. Take two personalities? To you act like you have a conscience, but you're just being sentimental. Isn't that right, Hoenn High? Oh, what the you hell? Think you can... How could it? Look at your own face. Oh. You can't change reality, only your perception. Tell me what you think you could actually change. I'm sick of watching people die, and I can't just sit back and take it anymore. I won't let anyone else get killed. We have to fight in order to live, and that's what will make us strong. Then think about us. 
Okay. <laughs> Man, that episode explained nothing. <laughs> I was like, oh, we're going to get some answers? No. no. Just more questions. <laughs> okay, so is he... It seems like he's talking with his dead people. With, maybe he, since he drank the Philosopher's Stone, he's interacting with the dead people. Kind of like how Bradley is. That's my guess. Bradley's talking with somebody. Oh, Bradley, yeah. Right. So when you drink the Philosopher's Stone, you become... you hear Split personality. Yeah, what's going on there? Is there someone? Does he have a twin? Like, as it implies, or is it just my bipolar? I'm wondering. Just is one of those episodes where they just cut budget. Uh, they had to do like reasons. a budget cut, so they had uh, to. Yeah, and they so just they put just together with this. Yeah. And the yeah. footage isn't even in order. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. So it felt like that was a big recap episode from like a long break. Yeah. I but wonder... with some new scenes in it, not something you see often. That is true. That's, yeah. that's very So it was worth watching. It was very interesting to see the father's point of view. Obviously now we know he's tied to the whole plot, like, duh. <laughs> Whether as a twin or... I don't yeah. think he's a twin. Yeah, I don't think he's a twin. I think he's bipolar. It's my guess. He's hearing all the voices in his head. Uh, the, I don't know uh, if he stone. has a split personality or not. Yeah. But so, we'll see, I guess. We, we don't quite know. I don't quite know what bipolar means exactly. The clinical uh, definition, anyway. Okay, well, split personality seems to be better. Maybe he feels some underlying guilt underneath all that. Yeah, that's my guess. And that's why he's tormented, whether he should proceed with his plan or not. And at the end... He decided, yes, he is going to proceed with his plan. It seems that's, like he is, despite yeah. looking at all the people who he used to hang out with. It feels like he thought of that, too. And it also... That was his wife. That was cool to see. Not often you hear yeah. her in the whole show. Especially from his perspective. Yeah. And he seems to imply that he's been around for a very long time. Makes me wonder if he is also a homunculus. Like, maybe he's the first one ever. But how was he able to have kids? Don't they become sterile? That is true. And yeah. it's very interesting. Then why would he create homunculi? Yeah, and the second thing is... Well, we heard Envy said that they destroyed Xerxes. What is that again? The town, the whole ancient city that was destroyed. Oh, yeah, that's Everyone right, that died there. You. And then he says that's all their souls. The Envy has all of them. Oh, yeah. So that means they're have... involved with the destruction. It must be like the first experimentation. They get a philosopher's mm -hmm. stone or whatever. Is Ishval the second experimentation? Because it was Either that or King it's Bradley. Like a, yeah. But then why would he kill them with their troops? Yeah. So there's... What we're trying to say is there's something going on. <laughs> Interesting episode. Yeah. Uh, it's I don't know if it's something I would watch if I do a rewatch personally. I, I'm just speaking. Well, for let's myself. skim through the scenes anyway. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, fast episode either way. Yeah. I feel like very quick. So I guess I'll have to watch the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed our reaction to episode 27, and we'll see you guys for episode 28 next time. Take care and have a good day.